So you guys want to know how to wall jump and have some advanced movement in Apex Legends? I'm going to show you how to do it in this video. Let's do it. Welcome back guys to my channel where I give you guys all the tips and tricks to improve your gameplay in Apex Legends. I'm Warlog and today I'm going to teach you guys how to do some advanced movement. We're going to teach you how to wall jump today. So let's hop over to the firing range and get right into it. All right, guys, now that we're in the firing range, I'm going to teach you today how to wall jump. Okay, this is an advanced movement guide teaching you how to wall jump, and I'm going to give you a little course on how to, you know, practice it and go through it. Wall jumping is an advanced movement that, you know, I recently learned how to do. What it does is, is it allows you to continue moving without losing any speed while you jump off of a wall or, you know, a truck, uh, a building, anything like that. The 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 whole guide to this is being able to continue moving without uh, being hindered in any way from a wall so this is essentially what it looks like so when you're going up to a wall you're going to want to slide jump off the wall and then jump again to do it but you got to look straight at it you got to look straight at the wall so when you're doing it you look and then you jump this gives you a lot of momentum, see, a lot of speed. You slide jump off, you have to look directly at it, and then it allows you to keep moving. The easiest way to practice this right off the bat is just to go straight, slide jump, and then jump off, okay? Uh, you're gonna need a bit, a little bit bigger wall, so I would advise coming all the way up to the firing range to this one right here. This is probably the best one to do it. You wanna slide jump, and then jump off the wall. Now, the trick to this is, is whether you're on PC or console is once you slide and then jump, you have to just for a quick second, you have to take your finger off of the joystick, right? Your movement joystick. So when I'm moving up, I'm not gonna move. I'm gonna slide, jump, take my thing off and then hit the jump button one more time to jump off the wall. Now, the other thing to note with this is that not only do you have to take your thumb off the movement stick or off of, you know, ASD for, or WASD for uh, PC, is that you have to hit jump again, but you have to be looking directly at the surface that you're gonna jump off of. So if I'm going straight, I'm just gonna slide jump, right? Take it off and then jump again, okay? Now, if I was coming from the side, then I have to turn this so I'm looking straight at it, right? Turn, just do it real quick, and then jump off. All you gotta do is turn it real fast, and then you can jump right off. Now, this movement trick has been done used by a lot of the pros, and see how I can just keep going? It allows you to get to different areas really, really quick. A good thing about this is being able to wall jump onto something, right? And then turn around and get to a higher spot, right? So if I wanted to get up onto a ledge that was behind me, instead of you know, climbing up and then having to jump backwards onto something, you could just wall jump to it, you know, just boom. And then you jump back up on top of something. It's a much more efficient and faster way to move in apex legends. It allows you to keep moving, right? Oh, I slid and did that wrong there, but slide down, turn, look at it and then jump off of it. Now, the course I want to teach you guys is to use these three pylons right here. This one, this, this one, and then the third one down there. And you could use this one if you want. Okay. The goal is to start here. Just come straight at it. Jump off, right? We're going to do that one more time. Just so we're just so we're on top of it. Slide, jump off, right? And then you're just going to kind of come at it from an angle. Because the majority of the time, you're going to be, you're going to be coming at an angle from things. So you just do it, jump off, boom. Now, not every time. It's tough to get it every single time until you kind of get it down. And then you just turn back and do the same course again. Jump off. Now, some surfaces that are, you know, a little bit lower, like a truck or something like that, unless you're jumping off the side, you know, you may, you may just clip it, right? You may just clip it. Like this surface right here, it's not the highest. So you may just end up, you know, doing a nice little wall jump or you may end up actually just climbing it but the goal here is is to practice this movement so when you're moving in the actual apex games that you you know you're mastering your movement to just to get yourself in better positions right because i could i could slide wall jump grab my gun and get into a better position against an enemy right and it doesn't hinder your movement you can move free and as you guys know in apex legends the best movement battle royale in the game i mean having a skill like this being able to wall jump is going to change your game in a lot of ways you're going to be able to get to a lot of positions that you didn't know you could get to 
again guys you're going to want to look straight at the surface turn just for a brief second you're going to want to take your thumb off of the stick just for a moment you know after you look at it look at it jump off right and then boom now when you get up to this and you're slide jumping you want to double tap your jump button right because if you just do it once then i'm just here i'm just holding this but if I double, if I double tap it, then that's where I'm jumping. Cause you're basically grabbing the wall and pushing off of it. Cause see, if I just grab the wall here, right? If I go to climb, uh, let me do the other one. You know, you're going to be able to just, right? I'm here. Now when you jump off, see, that's just a normal jump. But if I'm wall jumping, see, I just get to the surface without even having to do some crazy climb. You know what I mean? Now, the other trick to this is, is it's going to be a little bit harder, guys, to do without almost a maximum slide. You're going to want almost a maximum slide, if not a maximum slide. So if I'm here, it's going to be tough to kind of wall jump off that. You got to come into the full wall jump, into a full slide and jump off. Full jump and then boom. Right? See, I can't do it while I'm just like having a half slide. You're going to need a full slide. Look straight at, double jump off, boom, take your thumb off the joystick just for a second, bam. This movement is an advanced movement guy. I encourage you guys to do the course. If you guys do enjoy Apex Legends content, that is all that we do here on my channel is everything Apex Legends. My goal here is to try to improve your gameplay in any way, shape, or form, in any, anything down to the technicals, down to just overall gameplay, gun skill, movement, how to get better with certain legends that you use, anything like that. So if you do enjoy Apex Legends content, I encourage you to like and subscribe to the channel, guys. But again, this is something I'm still mastering, as you guys see in this little tutorial. I don't get it every single time, but I've been using it a lot recently in my games, and it just, it has made such a difference as far as moving around the map. You know, if you're facing off in the zone, if there's something hindering you in your way, you know, you can just bounce off of it, get over it without having it slow you down to take damage. Look at that, I can just get up the stairs. Boom, right, hit it, boom, I'm gone. Again, guys, I encourage you just to, you know, start straight on. At this one, it's a big enough wall so you don't have to worry about messing up. Run straight at it, slide, jump off, boom. And you guys just keep practicing practicing this. Now this, I do have a scuff. I'm using the Vantage 2, guys. The scuff Vantage 2 controller. This is an amazing controller. Shout out to scuff. They are not sponsoring me for this, but I've been using their stuff for about three years now, and I absolutely love their controllers. So if you don't have a scuff and you're playing Claw or something like that, you could go into the settings guys and change your controller config your button layout to like you know uh probably grenader or ninja button puncher something like that or bumper jumper is probably the best one uh because it changes jump to l1 so you could do that um to guys help you guys out if you don't have a scuff controller or anything that has um you know paddles on the bottom but this being able to wall jump is just an amazing ability guys i hope you really did enjoy this video i hope it helps you out um but wall jumping use it practice it it's going to make your gameplay and your movement even better in apex legends guys i want to thank you for watching the video if this video did help you guys out which i hope it did make sure to drop a like guys and if you're new to the channel make sure to hit that subscribe button guys we've had a lot of people enjoying the videos that aren't subscribed to my channel so make sure to hit that subscribe button guys turn on the notification bells we post videos every three days on how to improve your apex legends gameplay so and help me out we're almost to 600 subscribers on our freaking mission to a thousand subscribers so i really do appreciate everybody who has subbed and liked the videos and all that stuff so i appreciate you guys helping me out getting to a thousand um as for me guys i'm warlug as always stay gaming and i'll catch you guys in the next video peace